Witnesses said that after a suspected acid assault damaged a mother and her two children, the thug ran off, screaming, my eyes. Following the horrific incident in South London, police reported that nine people were hurt, eight of whom required medical care, including the three victims. Heroic bystanders who raced to the family's defense as well as responding police officers were among those injured. An inquiry has been opened by police following the trio's apparent throwing of a potentially caustic material on Lesser Avenue, Clapham South, and the Met Police are currently pursuing the attacker with a helicopter as part of a manhunt. Teams from the forensics unit were observed examining a coffee cup that might have been used to throw the acid. It was horrifying. A witness who claimed to have attempted to remove the poison off the woman's face told Sky News. First, a dad got his child, a two- or three-year-old girl, out of a white automobile. Twice, he flung her to the ground. I've never seen anything worse than what I saw. The woman was then thrown by the man. My eyes, my eyes, she exclaimed. After that, I hurried inside my house, took out a water bottle, and doused her eyes with water. Her lips were dark. She had burned skin. The lady in her twenties, who was his companion, mentioned that they had both returned from the hospital after some of the chemicals had gotten on her as well. In addition to the family, three other individuals were also injured and taken to the hospital in an ambulance. After arriving at the site, three more police officers sought medical assistance. However, it was reported that their injuries were not serious. Aside from the first three, everyone claimed to have been hurt inadvertently while racing to help the family. Images taken at the scene show a white Hyundai it wanty hatchback left unattended with its doors ajar on a street where houses can fetch up to three million. Photographs of the damaged car appear to show a broken windscreen and there is an abandoned hat nearby. In addition, forensics could be seen intently inspecting a silver thermal carry cup that was next to a bin. Labour's Lambeth, the Southwark London Assembly member Marina Amad wrote on X, saying, there has been a traffic collision with a man attacking occupants in a car and throwing acid. Among the victims are youngsters. Bell Ribeiro Addy, a member for Streatham, expressed her alarm over rumors of an acid attack. There's a noticeable police presence on the road that runs alongside Clapham Common. Ambulances and fire engines were also present at the location. Three of the nine patients seen by the London Ambulance Service were transferred to a nearby hospital and five of the patients were transported to a major trauma center. At the scene, the ninth was released. Additionally, the nearby Clapham South Belvedere Hotel is surrounded by barricades. Alexander Castle, the detective superintendent, stated, Officers are on scene following this horrific incident. A lady and her two small children are among the three casualties who have been brought to the hospital for medical attention. We suspect that three other individuals who came to their rescue also suffered injuries that required hospitalization. As soon as we have additional information about their conditions, we will update. Following their response to the event, three police officers were also transported to the hospital. Fortunately, we think their wounds are not too serious. We think the chemical to be corrosive at this point, but tests are still being conducted to identify its nature. One individual was observed leaving the area. In order to capture this person, we are utilizing resources from within the Met and investigations are still underway to find out what caused this terrible occurrence. We have assistance from the National Police Air Service. Any members of the public with information or materials that can assist us should contact 999 right away, referencing CAD 7790 January. A representative for the London Ambulance Service continued by saying that they had dispatched three ambulance crews two incident response officers, and members of their hazardous area response team to the location. It arrived shortly before 6.30 p.m. After being alerted to reports of an incident, we treated nine people, five of whom were sent to a major trauma center, the statement read. One patient was released from the site, while the other three were sent to a nearby hospital. According to a London Fire Brigade's spokesman, the crew was first summoned to Clapham South at 7.35 p.m. and left the site at 9.21 p.m. Firefighters were called to a chemical incident on Lesser Avenue in Clapham this evening, according to the statement. A mom and her two children received rapid emergency care from personnel working with emergency service partners. At the site, five more patients received treatment, 
Rescue teams from the London Ambulance Service transported them all to the hospital. Additionally, crews used specialized equipment to find what is thought to have been caustic material used in the event.